you have any, uh, is there any advice that you would like to share with these young actors and actresses yeah, that are coming you, up through you the know, ranks? One of the things that I, I think to me is like, one of the most important things, I guess, in anything we do, in, in life, in career, whatever, but in, 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 um, in show business, um, is uh, follow your instinct. Pay attention to what your heart and your mind tells you. Because um, when things are going on around you, and there are diff different voices with different opinions and so on, and they're coming from people you think are supposed to know, and a lot of time they don't, uh, you start, and I, because I know that's what I've done. I, uh, there were times when I didn't listen to my instinct. I wanted to, but I didn't have the courage to. Uh, so I would say, whatever is going on, step back, take a, a deep breath, whatever, and listen to what you're, you're telling yourself. Listen to your own instinct, because it's always right. It's always right. Excellent. Yeah. He wanted to know, how did you develop the character of Bernardo? Um, where did you start? Where yeah. did it come from? Um, that's interesting, you know, because uh, to uh, create a character, uh, um, because I had not studied acting uh, prior to that time, uh, my way of working, uh, and I, it wasn't a conscious way of thinking, it's just something that my instinct told me to do, and that was to identify uh, with the character, who he was, what he was going through, uh, what circumstances he had to live with on a daily basis, and so on. Um, and when I was in school myself, when I was in high school, you know, the, um, uh, you know there were uh, sororities and fraternities, and you know, the kids who were, I was asked once to, to join a fraternity, and uh, for some reason, I didn't want to do it. And I think the reason I didn't want to do it, I'm sorry, I'm getting to your answer, I hope, at the same time, uh, was because I didn't like this thing of some kids included and some kids excluded. You know, some kids were in, some kids were out. And I have never approved of kids doing that to each other, you know. So, uh, and so with Bernardo and, and the sharks, uh, the, the, they're... The Jets, for example, their family was the gang. Uh, the Sharks had families. They had mothers and fathers and grandmothers and cousins and each other. Um, but uh, so when they came to the, you know, to the new country or a new place, and when they were on the first day out on the street, they're looked down upon, you know, by the, they're called names. And, and, and so I've always, um, felt badly for anybody who, who has that kind of experience. Uh, so I, I think I identified with that aspect of Bernardo's character in, in West Side Story. And of course, he's going to have to rebel against that and, and, and fight against it, because it is wrong. You know? so. Hi, my name is Jordan, I guess. <laughs> and um, my question is, do you ever watch yourself in anything you do? And if so, what's going through your mind? Oh. Um, well, when it, when it was, you know, uh, when we were working on West Side, Natalie, Natalie Wood, mm -hmm. the beautiful, perfect, great Natalie Wood. Uh, um, but she was, a, she was 23, but she was a professional. She'd been in movies since she was a kid, you know. And she, went, she watched The Rushes every day. That's what you do. You watch her work, see what you've done, and see if you want to change anything or work on it. And one day she said, George, you know, to come to the rushes. I went to the rushes one day, and that was enough for me. I didn't want to see anything, you know. So, because um, uh, I've always found for me, uh, it's better not to look at myself. It's like it's kind of like being in, in the theater uh, and 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 uh, re if, reading a review. If, if a review is bad, it gets in your way. If it's good, it gets in your way. So uh, uh, it's better, I, I felt better. I've never felt comfortable looking at myself, let me put it that way. I've always liked just doing the work. And um, so now, with all these, a lot of years later, sometimes I can look at something and kind of, there was a, I, I had to go to a screening of West Side Story like about t 10 days ago. 
and I hadn't seen it in a long time, I still get uncomfortable. Uh, it's like I would have changed, I, you know, but that's a long answer to your question. I don't, I don't, I don't like looking at myself that much. <laughs> All right. George, thank you. <laughs> thank you. Maria The most beautiful sound I ever heard Maria